Shalom. I want to give all praises, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shah, Bahasham Rechakadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings and salutations to the sincere Akim across the globe that's laboring and pushing his word in all truth and sincerity. Case the brother Yah Rock from GMS Houston back once again. And uh, I just wanted to do a quick lesson. Uh, Lord willing, this will be edifying. But uh, just wanted to go into a. Uh, you know, it's going to come a time where, you know, we're going to suffer persecution, you know, for the Lord's sake, man. All right. Uh, but, you know, we shouldn't have fear, you know, uh, in the times to come. All right. And, you know, just continue to endure, man, you know. Uh, so I just had a couple of scriptures. You know, this won't be nothing long at all, but, you know. I'm going to start here at Acts 14 and uh, 14 and 22. All right. And starting here, you know, because we, you know, read about the the kingdom, man, you know. Um, you know, there's a thing, you know, uh, you know, the, the, the sweetness of the, of the word and the bitterness, man. All right. You know, you know, the, you know, the sweetness is uh, finding out who you are, you know, that you a Hebrew Israelite, you know, that you are the Lord's chosen, okay, that, uh, you know, the kingdom of heaven is for us, okay, um, that the Lord, um, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus, you know, finding out the true name, all right, which his name is Yahweh Shah, and the Most High, the Father, his name is Yahweh, okay, but knowing that the Lord died for us, okay, that we may receive salvation, man, okay, going to the scriptures, you know, uh, read everything uh that we're gonna have in the kingdom spiritual powers you know spiritual bodies all right had a law of statutes and commandments written in our, our our minds our spirits you know that we're gonna truly be able to live man you know to rule the planet and and, and beyond man all right you know just you know examples man you know of the sweetness of the scriptures man the sweetness of the word you know but there's also a, a bitterness man all right, before we get to that, the uh, trials are, you know, the things that we have to go through first, all right, before we get that, okay? And a lot of certain groups, other Israelite groups, you know, they always speak about, the, the, the you know, the, the sweetness, man. They don't ever go into the, the bitterness part, you know? They don't, you know, go into the times of Jacob's trouble, all right? You know what I'm saying? They always pushing the vibration of just being in the spirit of mirth, man. And, and we can have the kingdom right here and now. You know, you, you see what I'm saying? But no, man, that's not the case, man. So, uh, yeah, going to the scripture, man. This is Acts 14 and uh, 22. Okay, it says, confirming the souls of the disciples and exhorting them to continue in the faith. And that we must, through much tribulation, enter into the kingdom of the Most High. Okay? So, right, man, we should be exhorting each other, man, to continue in the faith, man. You know, uh, because, as the scripture says, through much tribulation, we will enter into the kingdom. Okay? It's not just going to be a, a simple thing of a snap of the finger and, bam, there it is. We, you know, we, nah, man, we're going to have to go through harsh times, man. Okay, you understand? So yeah, like uh, the scripture said, uh, once again, forming the souls of the disciples and exhorting them to continue in the faith and that we through much tribulation enter into the kingdom of the Most High. Okay, uh, real quick, this is uh, John 15 because the Lord himself, uh, you know, told us that you know, we were going to be persecuted as he was, man. Okay. Um, you see, uh, John 15, and I'm going to get to the point. Uh, I'll start at 18, John 15 and 18. If the world hates you. Right. If the world hates you, you know that it hated me before it hated you. If you were of the world, the world would love his own because 
but because you are not of the world, but I have chosen you out of the world, therefore the world hated you. We're in right, you know. We're, you know what I'm saying, uh, against this place, man. All right. See, this world, this current, uh, you know, kingdom that we up under, you know what I'm saying, they're, you know, it's completely contrary to the, to this word, man. Okay. This whole kingdom, all right, is anti Yahweh Shah, man. All right. Anti life. All right. Being under the rule of the, of the wicked, man. All right, okay. So just, you know, seeing how everything is, is, is ran. All right. It, it tells you that, you know, you see the ways of this world is, is contrary to this, man. All right. And for us, you know, being caught into the faith, man, and, you know, following after Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah, okay, you see, this this world is against that, man, so, you know, it's against us, man, all right, you see, um, this is, uh, verse 20, okay, John 15 and 20, remember the word that I said unto you, the servant is not greater than his Lord. If they have persecuted me, they will also persecute you. Okay? So, right, man. As the Lord Yahweh Shah said, man, it's going to come a time where we, you know, we're going to be persecuted, man. Okay? For, for righteousness sake, man. Okay? As they did the, uh, you know, the Lord, man. And all the prophets before, before us. Okay? Um... This is uh Second Timothy three and uh I'm gonna start at verse ten. Okay, it says But thou hast fully known my doctrine, manner of life, purpose, faith, long suffering, charity, and peace. And this is uh Paul by the way, alright? Uh it says Verse 11, persecutions, afflictions, which came unto me at Antioch, at Iconium, Lystra, what persecutions I endured, but out of them all, the Lord delivered me, okay, and the reason I'm bringing this out, just, you know, uh, for an example, man, just to uh, show that, you know, the Lord will do the same for us, man, okay, if we have faith, all right, and continue to believe and trust in Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah, okay. You see, the Lord will deliver us, okay. You know, and uh, I'm gonna finish this out. Verse 12 it says, Yea, and all that will live godly in Hamashiach Yahweh Shah shall suffer persecution, okay. So, right, man, you know, we're all, you know, it's gonna come a time, though, know, we are gonna go through it, man. All right, you see, going back to how I said, you know, it's not just going to be an easy walk into the kingdom, okay? You see, this uh, this devil, all right, Esau, Edom, you know, is, is going to come come at us, man. You know, for standing up, uh, you know, as true believers of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah, man. Okay, as so they did, you know, all the prophets before us. Uh, you know what I'm saying? As the, uh, they was against the Lord Yahweh Shah. Okay, you see, even amongst our own people, man. All right, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans. All right, you even had those amongst Israel that was against the Lord, man. All right, the uh, the, the ones that was calling for him to be crucified, man. Okay, so it, hey, it's gonna come a time where even amongst our own people, you know, your own household, your uh, some of your old family, you know, and the Lord spoke about that, okay, that they was going to uh, be against us, man, you know, you see what I'm saying, so, hey, you know, we still have to have that, uh, that faith and confidence, though, in, in the Lord that, you know, he's going to be with us, man, and not to, to, uh, you know, be shook, man, for uh, lack of better words, you know, but, uh, right, once again, 2 Timothy 3 and 12, yea, and all that live godly in Hamashiach Yahweh Shah 
shall suffer persecution. Okay. And I had this other script scripture, you know, Romans 15, uh, 15 and 4. You know, it says, For whatsoever things written before time were written for our learning, that we through patience and comfort of the scriptures might have hope. Okay? So, right, we used uh, these exa examples of our forefathers, man. All right? The, the examples of the faith that was displayed, you know, by our forefathers, man, you know, and, uh, you know, the, the prophets. Okay? You see? And to uh, build us up, man, to build our faith up, man. Okay? Because this is what gives us hope, man. This is what comforts us. All right? You know? Knowing that the Lord uh, will deliver us as well, man. All right? In these difficult times, man. Okay? And, hey, even, even now, man, you know, just look back at uh, everything that you've been through up until this point. All right? The uh, difficult times you've been through, you know, uh, like I said, up until this point, man. All right? You see? Did not the Lord make a way for you to uh, to get through it? Whatever it, uh, whatever it is that you have been through, you see? So in these times of persecution is uh, approaching, all right, the Lord will do the same, man. You know, if we, uh, you know, continue to have faith and trust in him and continue to walk according to his word, man. All right, displaying that faith, you know. Standing firm, man. All right. So that was pretty much, uh, you know, what I'm saying the point, man. Just, just going into how, you know, hey, man, the Lord uh, will look over us, man. All right. And we must go through these things, you know. It's not going to just be a, a smooth transition into the kingdom. Okay. You see. All right. So uh, I just wanted to go into that. Um, once again, all praises, glory, and honor unto Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rechakadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings and salutations to the sincere Akim. Continue to push this word in our truth and sincerity. Shalom.